Tecla Structures is our, our main platform. So that's what we see used for detailing of various kinds of structures, whether you're doing steel, precast, rebar detailing. There's a lot of different markets that Tecla Structure is used in currently, and it's expanding all the time, but essentially it's if you want to do your modeling, your detailing, and then your drone production, and all of the manufacturing information that comes with that. So it can be used by anyone really, anyone who's involved in the project and who's going to get value from that 3D detailed model. So it could be someone who just wants to view the model, it could be someone who uh, just wants to do an estimate model. I guess the main breadth is detailers. They would use Tecla for doing a model and then from there they'd create detailed components and such as connections, rebar, things like that. And then it's getting that information down into 2D is the next stage. So that would be your general arrangement drawings, fabrication drawings, all that information automatically generated from the model. And then the other step would be generating any manufacturing information. So it could be NC files, rebar bending schedules and files, and then collaborating. So once you've got that 3D model, there's so much more you can do with it rather than keeping it siloed within the company. You then can share that out to the architects, engineers, anyone who's involved in the project can get the benefit of that fully detailed model. From my experience, personal experience as well, is moving from that 2D environment, 2D drones to, to a 3D model environment, transformational for you know, anyone who's using it. You use that software to design as you would fabricate or design as you would build. As you're building that model, you get an understanding of the model and you can rotate that around and get a real feel for what it is that you build. Once you've got that model fully detailed, you've collaborated with everyone. Everyone can view the model, make comments. Being able to collaborate in the 3D model is, you know, it's invaluable having everyone on the same page as the, as the model's being created. But once you've got to that stage, just being able to automatically generate those drones, the stuff that you spend hours and hours doing in a 2D environment can be done in minutes. The manufacturing information, can kind of NC files for CNC, that kind of thing you can't get from, you know, the 2D environment, and it's all just generated automatically. So that's kind of the biggest, biggest benefit that I see personally in in using Tecla for, for anyone who's looking to get involved with the trial. We see Tecla structures used extensively in the estimation and bidding stage. This means you can take 2D information from architects, or you can even take 3D information from the likes of Revit as an architectural package, convert that into IFC, and then you've got your bill of materials there ready to go. So you get all that information in there, and you'd get linear weights of your material, you'd get an idea of the lengths that you'd need to cut so you can really do your forward planning at, at an early stage and get everyone on board early on. Share that out through Trimble Connect as well. And then, you know, you can get people commenting on the 3D model at an early stage as well. So we see Tecla structures used in the project plan and execution stage quite extensively. With having the 3D model there, you can actually plan for things like lifting. So if you've got a really heavy object or a really awkward object that needs to be lifted, let's say it's in a city centre area, then you can need a really solid lifting plan because it's you're gonna have to have road closures things like that you're gonna have to understand where your crane is so you can put all that within the model and do kind of planning for lifting we see a lot in off-site construction where you have sequences so you can put your sequence in within tecla as well and then do your planning from there uh, but you can also plan for your production uh, plan for erection on site so Everything's in there with tools within the, the software that you can use for that side of things. So Tecla Structures is it's a great tool for design and detailing. We interface with a lot of different analysis software. The main one being Tecla Structural Designer, which of course is one that is part of the Tecla portfolio. But from there, once you've got a, a, a model with your, your steel sections designed, you can then start doing your detail and so you'd add your connection details, any kind of simple connections, moment connections. They can all be done within the software. 
You can also do custom components if you want to start automating the connections and, and kind of designing your own connections within the system as well. From there, this is your detailing stage. So this is where Tecla really comes at its own because you can start generating the fabrication drawings in minutes. So they're all done automatically. They all run off templates. You can customize the templates to your own kind of company standards. We give you default ones that you can use, which are really good as well. You would use Tecla structures for design and detail for any kind of project that you're involved with, whether that's steel, concrete, timber, like metal framing, uh, you know, off-site volumetric, you see it used a lot for. The main benefits are the kind of level of detail that you can get in there. So whether that's connections, rebar, embeds, anything like that, you can get it all in the one model. And you can see how they all interface with each other as well. You can kind of perform clash checking. You can get advanced bill of materials on things like bolts, plates, embeds, rebar, all that can be pulled from the model at an early stage and then sent into manufacture. So the, the outputs you can get from Tecla structures are pretty expansive. Um, you can do everything from CNC output, so that could be saw drill lines, CNC machines for you know plates. You can also, if you're doing precast or rebar, you get all of your uh, bar bending information from there as well. So you can actually put in layout points in the model as well and export them out to real life coordinates on site. The main feature of Tecla structures is the ability to model any kind of material. So whether that's steel, concrete, timber, like metal framing, you can do it all within the one system. So it's really good if you, if you need to do an integrated model or hybrid type of model, you've got all materials available there. You've also got your 2D drawings. So this is really important, that 2D information and being able to generate that quickly. So the drones are all automatic, but the other thing is the drones are all linked back to the model. So any updates in the model, the drones automatically update in the background. You've got a list of components in there, so standard components that you would use in all of your day-to-day -day detail. But you also have the flexibility through custom components and API to start generating your own company-specific components. When you create a Tecla Structures project, you also create a Trimble Connect project in the background, and you'll find a tab in there named Trimble Connect. And all of this is once you've got that model, uh, no matter what stage of detail it's at, you can actually then upload that model to Trimble Connect. And that means anyone who's involved in that project can then come in and view that iteration of the model. So whenever you're ready to update, you just upload the model. So it's a really, really slick interface. So another key benefit of Tecla structures is the ability to model any size uh, structure. So we see it used um, any you know really small secondary steelwork, stairs, handrails, things like that, right up to you know skyscraper level buildings. So it really is can be you know it's versatile enough that it can be used on any size project, no matter what. Tecla Structures does integrate with Tecla Structural Designer. So you can start a model in Tecla Structural Designer, get your design correct, and then once you're ready to push that to, it's a direct transfer to Tecla Structures. And then from there, you can do your kind of detailed design. So that'll be adding things like your rebar, steel connections, precast design, anything you want to do to take that model further into that um, detail and manufacturing stage. There are some limitations to the trial, um, the main one being on the manufacturing information side. You can create drones within the model. You can't actually print those drones off or send them out. The other limitation would be you can't generate CNC information from the model, so things like NC files, um, you can't do that in the trial model. But if you do have a, a model available that you've created in the trial and you go for the commercial version after that, and then you can generate that kind of information. There's no part limitations uh, within the trial for Tecla structures. You can do a fully developed model without having to worry about any kind of limitations. So the Tecla structures trial lasts for 30 days once you've activated that trial. When you do activate the trial, 
that if you're in the UK, that you select that Tech That Structure as Trial UK because that would bring in the UK environment and all of the kind of templates and attributes associated with the, with the UK. When it comes to uh, learning material, you've got a few options available there. You've got learn.trimble. On there, you'll find the first steps for tech instructions. You'll also find that within the trial itself, when you, when you start that up, you should see notification there for the first steps. The other thing you've got that's built into the software is the instructor pane. So what that does is if you hover over an object on the ribbon, let's say, that will assist you in giving you a step-to-step -step guide on what to do with that function. The other thing to look out for is along the bottom ribbon of the software, you get guidance in there as well, which tells you where to click and what the sequence needs to be. The e-learning for Tecla Structures is free. Um, you can register for that with your Trimble ID and then get started straight away with the trial. If you do want to progress further with the license and with training, then do have options available for what we call the intermediate training. This is a training course that we host online uh, and details can be you know, sent out if you need more information on that further down the line. The so Techlight User Assistance, it's a resource that we provide and in there you'll find answers to most questions that you have in regards to the software. And you put a search term in there and Techlight User Assistance will pop up with some suggestions and you should be able to find the answer to most questions within that resource. There's three products in the subscription. So you've got your Tecla Structures license, Tecla Model Share and, and Trimble Connect Business Premium. Tecla Structures has three different configurations or subscription plans. You've got the Carbon license. So this is essentially a viewing license. So this is anyone who would like to collaborate on a project. Typically it's a project manager or, or someone like that. So they really need access to the model to be able to view it, uh, to view drones, to check dimensions on drones, or just to print drones. You've got the graphite license, which is a made function license. So this is if you want to create things like engineering models or estimate models. So you could do a, essentially a stick model of a structure and then from there create things like general arrangement drones, some kind of bill of materials can be pulled from there as well. And then the other configuration is your diamond license. So that's the, the full detail and license. So that would be anyone who's looking to create a fully detailed model all of the manufacturing information, such as drones, machinery information, such as CNC, rebar, bending, and then send that into a manufacturing environment. So the diamond package allows you to do everything that the carbon and the graphite would do. So it means that you're covered for all bases. So whether you want to view a model, create an estimate model, or a fully detailed model. It also gives you the ability to create fabrication level drones, fabrication level information and share all that information out. The Tecla Model Sharing is a, it's a cloud platform that we provide where you can host your models there. But the other key thing with the Tecla Model Sharing is that you can actually work with other Tecla users on the same project, whether that's in-house or you know, externally, you have the option to do that. Trimble Connect Business Premium is a collaboration tool. It enables our customers to send data files between each of the stakeholders. Uh, it allows them to access and view different models, whether that be Tecla Structural Design or Tecla Structures, Revit files even, and be able to actually look at, at that data and interrogate the models themselves. They can also send information to site, should they need to, to other users of Trimble Connect, who can access that through their phones, laptops to make it easy for our customers to share that data as effectively as possible between multiple stakeholders, between multiple stakeholders.